everybody welcome back to my channel thank you for joining me today if you are new to this uh, channel uh, welcome and please do click subscribe and your notification button to be notified when I put out new content okay let's dive right in so today is my first update if you let's recap so if you watched my previous video i pretty much decided i was going to start doing intermittent fasting and uh to start i was going to go with the 24 so 20 hours fast four day four hours uh, as my eating window well guys I am happy to come back and report to you that it is more than I thought it would be it is everything plus more <laughs> yes um where do I begin I love it okay uh, okay let's maybe love hate situation <laughs> because I'm still getting accustomed to it but it is amazing how I feel in just seven days so today is day seven and I don't think I ever want to go back to the way I used to eat at least not anytime soon. Oh my god, there's something in my eye. Perfect. Yes, so I do not want to go back to the way I was eating. So the first day I actually went 22 hours. I went by my goal by two hours. And I kid you not, I was not hungry. I don't know. I don't know if it's because I went into this with a positive mindset that I was going to love it. I don't know if it's because I've done enough research and I'm confident about what I'm doing. But it's amazing. Like day one, I went straight to 22 hours. The second day I did 21 hours. From that time since I've been doing 21 or 22 hours. And then today I decided to push even further since it's my last day um, for the update anyways. I went with almost near 23 hours. So that's great. And um, I, I'm sleeping better like I can fall asleep and just be rejuvenated by the time I awake in the morning and to think like seven days ago each morning I woke up I would feel so exhausted not in the past four days I wake up I'm ready to go Basically, I've just been eating one meal a day and what I've been doing is I'll start with about almost a quarter of a watermelon to like just hydrate the inside of my stomach. I do drink water during my fasting, but the past week I've decided to break my fast with watermelon first before I eat anything else. If not watermelon, then cucumbers. So something very high in wanted water density, which cucumbers and watermelons are great for that. Um, yeah, so the sleep is good. I'm not as hungry as I thought I would be. I mean, force of habit. I've been looking at the clock, like my brain is like, one is like, when are we eating, girl? We should have been eating like three meals ago. But I'm so proud of myself. I've stayed true to acquiring discipline when it comes to food. And it's just been a week and I'm so proud of myself for just not letting this one slide. And... I'm going to push it to 21 days and see how I feel. I downloaded this life fasting app 
It pretty much documents all my fasts from beginning to end. It shows when I kick into ketosis. That basically just means my body is burning fat and not carbohydrates for fuel. I'll post uh, snippets of pictures in this video towards the end just to show you how I did for the last seven days. Um, yeah, so the next the next 14 days, I'm just working on just narrowing it down further and further. My goal is to do a three-day fast straight, three days straight. Yeah, so that's 72 hours just drinking water. Yeah, and just allowing my body to heal and just relax. I'll tell you this. I have went down from 325. I'm so embarrassed saying this, guys, but I let my weight get to that. I'm a five foot, half inch person i'm supposed to be at 105 110 pounds that's my ideal weight for my height but i'm sitting at i was sitting at 325 seven days ago i've been at that number since march so six months and in the last seven days i went from 325 to 216 I wish I took a picture of my weight at 325, but I've attached my picture I took this morning. I'm so happy. I'm over the moon, but I also need to remind myself that this is about me getting healthy and not just weight loss. The weight is just a bonus, but I can tell you that when you're fasting, the first weight to go is near your midsection at least that's it for me i wore um something that was a little bit tight last week and this week it's just uh easier to put on so i'm so excited to see what the next 14 days are going to bring for me and after the 14 day is complete and i'm okay i would like to do uh, uh i would like to further challenge myself and perhaps do the three day fast. If sooner, then great. I'm just going to let my body talk to me and let me know when it's ready to commit to something longer. If you have tried fasting, I would love your feedback. If you're confused and concerned about me, comment below. I'll be happy to answer your questions. Um, I have found a community uh it's called alternative health uh, uh an alternative health yeah a health alternative a healthy alternative <laughs> i'm blanking out i'm blanking out yeah yeah so there, there are lots of people there fasting. It's a great space to engage with other people that are doing fasts and stuff. So it's motivating and encouraging to me. Um, my skin loves it. My body loves it. I'm getting energy to stay awake and play with my kids. So they are getting happier too. I'm getting happier. I'm bonding with them. I'm just hoping I can maintain this because this is good. This is good. So why not stick with it? It was definitely a challenge when it comes to discipline, but I can see I'm building, I'm building that muscle slowly. It's too early to jinx it, but I would like to be very strong in terms of discipline around eating and food. My birthday is coming up in October, so I really want to look good and feel good. You know, I want to, you know, be on my way to being at a healthier space. My body and my mind should be aligned. Yeah, so thank you so much for joining me. I'll catch you in the next video. I'm not sure what it's going to be about.
but I might surprise you. I'll also attach the Life Fasting app for those that may be interested. I am overjoyed to go from 325 to 316 in a week. It's remarkable. So yeah, um, if you're wondering about my lashes, I love them. They're beautiful. I got them from Amazon. I'm in my bedroom. I don't know if you can read. Uh, it's magnetic. They have six pairs in there. It comes with the liner and the um, little thing, the clipper thing you use to hold it. They're beautiful. They're gorgeous. They're light. They have five bones of magnet on each lash. So, yeah, you could fly. The wind could blow and you could literally fly and those lashes would still be stuck on you yeah i'll put a link below on um, where to find it if you love it it's not sponsored i just thought i should share because look at that gorgeous just beautiful yeah so thank you so much guys i love you all all my 38 subscribers <laughs> thank you so much for being there for me and creating this space for you guys to um, help me get to my destination. Have a lovely day and take care of each other. As promised guys, I'm going to attach my weekly vlogs I took along with my weigh-in and my fasting stats. Good morning. It is August 20th and I am beginning my fasting Technically, I started yesterday because to make it a 20-hour fast, I figured I could have my last meal at 6 p.m., which would make my first meal at 2 p.m. today. So that makes it a 20-hour fast. Um, yeah, I had a glass of water about an hour ago just with a, a cap of apple cider vinegar. So hopefully that keeps my blood sugar level. And yeah, so here's to day one. I'll keep you posted. Good morning, guys. It's day two of my 20-hour fasting. I just woke up and I'm drinking some apple vinegar water. Apple cider vinegar water, anyways. Just a cap of it. With some warm water, it helps curb the hunger and just give me some electrolytes. Yeah, um, my last meal yesterday was at 6.30, so I don't get to eat till 2.30. Yesterday was amazing. I didn't even feel hungry, and I went for 22 hours and 15 minutes. I'm going to add screenshots of my fasting hours from the Life Fasting app, and yeah, it just kind of gives you a recap of how many hours I fasted, how many hours I was in ketosis, and all of that. And I found I was easily able to eat um, low-carb foods. I wasn't craving carbohydrates yesterday. It's amazing. Day one. Good morning, beautiful people. Yeah, um, it's not morning, actually. It's 12-something. Uh, um, let's see, 12.40. Hectic morning. My youngest was just so clingy today, like cling wrap. And when that happens, the older one also wants major attention. Hmm? I'm telling you, it's a hustle. But yeah, I'm alive. I had a glass of water about a few hours ago. I'm not hungry, but I am tired because I didn't sleep well. My fault. Total stupidity. Lucifer came out yesterday, the fifth season, and I binged it till 2.30 a.m., which is horrible because when you're in the process of getting healthy, sleep plays a major role, and I know I'm not doing right by myself. So I'm exhausted. Hopefully that doesn't derail me, but I'm feeling great, you know? I'm starting to feel my stomach shrink. Yesterday I had rice during lunch, about half a cup, but I just ate... Uh, 
sauteed kale and some beef for dinner uh, before 5.30. Yeah, so the fasting is going well, no complaints. Uh, yeah, I'll catch up with you later. I will be breaking fast in about a couple hours from now. Technically, I could eat after 1.30 because that's when the 20 hours ends, but I'm gonna stick around till 2 30 because it's just a nicer time to start eating for me um it just bounces off to when i end my eating which is before 6 30 uh yeah thank you for joining me and yeah see you tomorrow bye good morning guys it's day four of my fasting i feel like when i say that it's like i've been fasting straight for four days for my 20 hour fasting and four hour eating window and i feel great and um i think i really like this uh, it's still a little bit hard but um um yesterday i went for 21 hours so i'm so excited you never know i might do a full day fast that would be amazing eventually but not now yeah so i got on the scale and for the last six months i have been stuck at 325 and I got on the scale today, guys, and it said 319 in four days. Like, I feel ecstatic. Um, yeah. So, um, I can't eat right now up until 3.30 today. Because I want to see if I can do 21 hours again. The life fasting app I'm doing is, like, if you go for a longer fast, it pushes you to keep it or go higher it doesn't recommend going back to a lesser hour so yeah that's what's going on it's day four i'm loving this um yeah i'll keep posting i'll keep uh, vlogging and then i'm just gonna post it all together my daughter's up so i get to go bye guys good morning guys uh we're on to day five of my fast fasting my 20 hour fasting for our eating type of eating i don't want to call it a diet because i have a bad history with those yeah but rap morning this one over here hurt her hand well i hurt her hand i lifted her by one hand yesterday and she seems to be sore i think i hurt her wrist so she's just been so sour and nothing can touch her hand or she screams bloody murder yeah but uh, we had pizza yesterday for dinner. I just wasn't feeling it because she was crying so bad. Didn't have the patience to cook. Yeah, but I still ate in between 3.30 and 6. So I still kept my window. And yeah, I just felt very sleepy and drowsy because of pizza and stuff yesterday. But I felt so full after my second slice. And I think that's just a sign my stomach is shrinking, which is good because I know it's a large stomach in there. So... If we just get it to half, that would be great. Yeah, so I'll catch up with you guys later. Um, I don't get to eat today until 3.30 if I want. So 2 o'clock or 3.30 if I want. I just want to maintain the 21-hour window. Okay, tune in later. Bye. Good morning, y'all. I'm hiding in the bathroom because my kids want me alone. <laughs> Seriously, mom, life is hard, yeah. But yeah, it's... Day five or day six? Day five. I don't know. I think day six. Yeah, it's day six. I was sure. Yeah, day six. I started on the 20th. It's the 25th today. So, yeah, it's been six days of following a fasting lifestyle of eating. And yesterday I went for 22 hours and 30 minutes. So proud. Yeah, I feel good. Um, I kind of noticed some changes to how my stomach feels, Mommy. and it's great. Mommy. She found me. She found me, yo. Safe. I need to be saved. Yeah, and um, I haven't had a menstrual cycle in a while, and today it did a comeback. So, <laughs> clearly I'm doing something right, because it's cleaning up the pipes in there. Whatever was clogged up is getting cleaned up. So, this is good. This is really good.